Hello everyone! In the last video, we showed you how a Cutie Pie tablet prototype is assembled. But in this video, we are going to focus on the UI and show you some of the features that we have implemented for the Cutie Pie shell. With the MCU firmware and its ADC function flashed to the board, you will notice that the battery level reading feature on the upper right corner is already functional. When you plug in the power source to the USB Type-C charging port, the status and the icons change accordingly to reflect the current charging state. The sleep-wake button is now working as well, as you can see here. If you swipe down from the right-hand corner of the screen, you'll see a typical Wi-Fi configuring UI. Choose an access point, and it should prompt you to enter the necessary security details. On the upper left corner of the screen, you will find the application tabs. This is where you can find the launched apps, and switching between them is as easy as clicking on any item on the list. Press and hold the new tab button to open a new terminal window. And as you can see here, the same on-screen keyboard works with this terminal emulator. Lastly, the Cutie Pie shell's view can now read the information from the gyroscope. So, if you do something like change the physical orientation of the tablet, the UI follows as well. And that's all for today's update. We hope you have enjoyed this demo of the Cutie Pie shell. You'll find more information on our blog post and the Cutie Pie Shell's GitHub repository together with all the source codes. Thank you for watching.